Hey there, collectives, and welcome back for a general reading. This reading is going to be for whoever it's supposed to be for. <laughs> Only take the part that fits and discard the rest. Happy birthday to the Scorpios who may be tuning into this video. I hope you guys are having a very, very good celebration here. Speaking of Scorpio, I got the same card that came out of one of Scorpio's other reading here. So this is dating times here. So you could be having somebody here who wants to work on a relationship. For some of y'all, you may be working at, at, at a place here and you the, 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 the owner may be want to date you. For some of y'all, you date, you work at this big corporation or this big business here. And you got the, the boss that's checking you out. You may be secretly seeing the boss. Somebody has, somebody may be dating their boss here. Could be some, could be a wealthy man wanting to come in here and um, offer you a job and you're going to end up dating this person. bad health in the reverse like I feel like if somebody has been struggling maybe you take an eel here and you got behind or you know maybe you lost your job maybe this is on a job you may have been sick sick and the uh, maybe the boss could possibly be wanting to help you financially and I think it's because this part, see, this person going to want to come give you a gift. See, it's what I saw. See, if you were ill, see, you may have gotten some unexpected news here for somebody. You may, somebody may give you some insurance. Somebody may help you bury somebody here. Maybe you didn't have no finances for somebody. You may have found out that somebody unexpectedly passed on here and you, you, they, they had bad health and they end up passing on and, but with the bad health is in the reverse, I feel like they're going to bounce back. Maybe somebody is, 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 was on their sick bed here. And somebody comes into your life and they change your life here is what I see. See, for, some, for somebody, wow, for somebody, it's almost like the, the pretty girl here. Somebody finna come in here and change your life here. It's almost like somebody here who could have been down and out and here come this big, this big wealthy person to come in here and change your life here. It's what I see. You could have been, you could have been unemployed or looking for work here. You could have been struggling financially. And here this ball, this wealthy person is coming in your life to change. You may see this person while you're traveling. This person is part, see, for somebody, your poverty, you about to be something, see, see, poverty in reverse and sudden wealth, see, you could, you could have been, you could have been somewhere where your whole community was mocking you because maybe you lost, maybe you got evicted here. And I feel like you couldn't find any, any help or support from your community. And now here this person is who's been wanting to date you, this wealthy person here. It's almost like somebody, it's almost like somebody going to come in here and rescue you is what I feel like. Somebody's about to be rescued here by this boss here. I feel like if you, if you were working hard, it's almost like a Cinderella story. You may have not had the finest things because you may have been struggling some type of way here. It may have been affecting you, affecting your health because of the things that you have been struggling with. You could have had people making fun of your clothes, the type of clothes you wear. Maybe you didn't have the best clothes. Maybe you were really struggling to provide for yourself. For somebody, you're going to end up getting a gift here from somebody here. It could be an inheritance. Cause, and I feel like this is somebody's about to go from rags to riches, and that's just what I feel. So let's see. Give me some more information for the collector. What's going on with this bad health in the reverse? Uh, what is that? The hermit in the reverse. Soul searching, introspecting, finding the light, finding the truth. Healing here. Uh, in instructions here. Uh, 
I feel like somebody here is sending, somebody could be, it's almost like the universe is answering somebody's prayers. Somebody could have been on their sick bed here and, and been praying out here. And little do you know, the universe is about to answer your prayer. See? Six of Pentacles. For somebody, you may be about to finally get awarded some type of disability funds here. What's up with this message of concern here? You may have, somebody may have gotten some bad results in from their doctors and they was doing bad here. Maybe somebody couldn't afford their medicine. And like, I feel like either you're about to start getting some type of assistance here, like a monthly assistance here. See the fool. I feel like somebody, I feel like somebody, and there go the teacher. And they go to Eight of Swords here. Somebody may be waiting for some test results here too, okay? Somebody may be waiting for test results on something. And like I said, it's just something, you, but something's about to ha happen good for you. Somebody may have found out that, that um, like they owe somebody some money. Maybe somebody realized that they couldn't pay something here. Maybe, maybe somebody goes out there and their last two dollars go to the casino because they, they ain't got, they just got lost everything or they lost them. It's almost like somebody here could, could really fumble upon a, a very lucky moment here. I don't feel like it's a lucky moment. I feel like this is the universe answering somebody's prayers, but it's just going to be unique on how it happens. You could be walking down the street and find some money with this fool card and this big ass ace of pentacles. You may walk down the street and find something here. For somebody, you're going to walk down the street and you're going to find a big lump sum of money with this fool and this ace of pentacles. What's up with this occupation for the collective? Why is this here? Occupation. See there, I told you. The queen of staff, see? In the reverse. Like, I feel like this is somebody here who, like, I feel like seeing you got balance, see? Ooh, I see it. See, you somebody here who may have not had all of the, you may have been very, very insecure because maybe you, your job was straining you. Maybe you were not being appreciated on your job. Maybe you didn't have employment here. But little do you know, even in your despair, you still got the attention of this wealthy man here. See, you see, you see what they say, favor ain't fair. Because that's what I see. I see somebody here who has the bare minimums. And they're, and they're working right alongside somebody here who may have the best home, the best cars, and, and, but their attitude is garbage. And it's almost like the, the one here who is the humblest, who has the least, is the one who's going to get this wealthy person's attention. What's up with this uh, courtship? Oh, ten of cups, see? <laughs> Oh, snap. Oh, snap. Now, let's say let's say if this ain't no work or situation here, maybe it ain't about work. Maybe you lived in this community here and you fell on hard times here and everybody was you couldn't find help in the community because they were judging you and misjudging you because you didn't have what they had. OK. Uh, and I see somebody here. Health may have been getting bad because of the stress that they were dealing with because of probably a job that they had to do a lot of labor, but they're not getting paid as much money. Um, the job had somebody's imbalance here. Somebody may have had to work on their feet, stand on their feet all day working. And, and, and this job consumed every, somebody's whole day. They, they didn't even feel, it's almost like this job, this occupation took up somebody so much of their time that they didn't even have time to girly up here. See somebody always wearing sweatpants, hair, you know, not fixing themselves up and really not, you really not feeling themselves. Somebody menstrual cycle could be imbalanced because of their job that they do, especially if they stand up. If, if I hear warehouse, if you were in the warehouse, you stand up on your feet. It's just brought in a whole bunch of imbalance here. But with the star card, like I say, even even you feeling at your worst, you still outshine everybody else. And the universe has you. The universe is leading this person to you. This is why, like, I feel like this person may have always been checking you out. See, there go the three of cups. I feel like this person has always been checking you out. Let's say if it ain't on no job, let's just say in the community here, this could be somebody here. It could be a, a politician for somebody. It could be a politician. It could be a, um, this is a, this is a business owner here, 
But this person has been watching you. Somebody may not have had transportation. Somebody may have saw you walking or saw you on a bus stop here. This person has been watching you. Some, like I say, somebody's about to go from poverty to wealthy here. Because you got the Ace of Pentacles and the Six of Pentacles. Now you got this gift. Why is this gift here for the collective? Clarify the gift. You could be Aquarius or dealing with Aquarius, Taurus, Virgo, or Capricorn, Cancer, Scorpio, or Pisces. What's up with this gift? Seven of Swords. Mm. I feel like for some of y'all, this is going to be a silent partner here. See, that, that's why it's, I feel like somebody want to do something for you, but they may not want everybody to know it with the nine of cups. Ooh. See, I can see it. I can see it like if it's on the job, too, because everybody else is going to be jealous of this. If, if you was to get an extra attention or, 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 or extra bonus or something, everybody would notice and they would they would feel like something's going on. So this person is trying to sneak you a gift with the seven of swords and the nine of cups here. Because like I said, it's too much competition. There's too many people here. Mm -mm. What's up with this wealthy man? Nine of swords. I feel like this person here deals with a lot of things daily, okay? I feel like this person, as a wealthy man, you would think that this man has it all together. But I feel like this person still lacks love in their life here, okay? This is somebody here who may have a back problem here. I even see somebody here who may possibly have a cane, but they are a wealthy man, but they don't sleep good at night. This is somebody here who could do anything that they could fly all over the world. They could do whatever they want to do, see? See, you, you're the one, see, spirit is drawing you to this, drawing you, this person to you. Could be a Leo here. Like I say, this is somebody here that wants a relationship. Oh, this person tired of sleeping alone. That's why you got the courtship and the ten of cups and the three of cups, see? Because this is somebody here who is not happy. They're not happy. And lo and behold, they're going to be entered into your life. And like I say, you could be this queen of wands in the reverse where you're not, where you're feeling kind of, agitated, not feeling all attractive to being pampered and spoiled as the privileged, privileged lady is what I feel like. Why is the privileged lady here? Feel like you're going from rags to riches again. See the lover. See, didn't I tell you, I tell you, you're going to stand out even at your worst. See, because you got big daddy, you got big daddy going to make a change for your baby. See, see king of pinnacles. Didn't I tell you, I told you. See, <laughs> <laughs> Big Daddy said that they ready to, to spawn somebody, god dang it. Ooh, see there? And this person ain't going to play about you either. Somebody's about to go from rags to riches because somebody's about to come in here and change their whole life because they are in a financial position to do it and they are looking to settle down and it just so happened that whoever you are, whatever you're going through in your life fits right into what they're dealing with in their life. All they need is somebody to spend their money on and somebody here who they can share life with and all you need is somebody to support you and to have your backbone and you got the right type of energy that's coming your way. So for some of y'all, whatever you may be struggling with financially, all of that is about to change. If folks have been picking with you because maybe you're still single, they feel like you're struggling because you're doing things alone, you're going to have somebody here very, very important coming into your life and whatever you were struggling with, poverty in the reverse, you're about to hit a sudden wealth because of the type of person that's coming your way. And indeed, it is a wealthy man. And they're going to make you because of how they invest and spoil you. You're going to become that bitch. And that, that's just some point blank period. See there? You got to be careful who you make fun of because the, 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 the person sitting right next to you that you are making fun of is going to be the wealthy person that you may have to look up to. All right, Collective, that's your reading. If it resonates, please like, share, and subscribe.